3D printing is becoming a more and more popular technology. Why? Because it offers plenty of room to our fantasy. We imagine an object, we digitalize it, and we obtain it in our hands, at a reasonable cost. One of the remaining challenges is the, the printing of objects in the micron range. As a consequence, the fundamental brick, the so-called voxel, the three-dimensional pixel, must be a cube with a side smaller than one micron. This is too small to follow the printing process with our eyes. If we cannot see, which other sense can we exploit? We relied on the touch. In our laboratory, we invented the Fluid FM, a flexible syringe with a sub-micron aperture at its apex. When a material is released through the aperture and grows underneath, we observed that it touches the syringe, bending it. We took advantage of exactly this moment to regulate the process. As example, we could even print metal microstructures via electrochemical reduction. Thanks to the joint contribution of PhD, masters, but also bachelor students, we synchronized the electronic components, achieving a true voxel by voxel, layer by layer protocol, which enables the fabrication of chosen microstructures at will.